Do you struggle with headaches and erectile dysfunction? I've seen this pattern in my clinic and it could be due to poor blood circulation. I have a simple self-care acupressure protocol you can do at home. It's Anita Tatabarthi. I'm a licensed acupuncturist with over 20 years of experience. I've treated 100,000 patients in my lifetime. I've seen this pattern and it could be that we are not getting enough blood circulation to the head, relieving the headache, the stress and the tension, and also not getting the blood flow we need to the genitalia so that you can have the firmness and duration satisfaction in the bedroom. Now, before I step into it and share with you the protocol, I always tell my patients with headaches and erection related issues, just go to the doctor and the screen to confirm that there is nothing serious going on. We want to have that peace of mind. So be sure to do that. If you are working with your doctor, you can absolutely do the self-care protocol along with his or her recommendations. So for this protocol, I want to go to the face and it's really rejuvenating and can help the headache specifically by bringing blood circulation to that area. Also, due to the intelligence of the mirror imaging, where the acupressure points on the face also mirror image the genitalia. So we are not only bringing blood flow to relieve the headache, but we are also training the blood flow to the genitalia so that you have that opportunity to work towards having that firmness and duration in the bedroom. So the acupressure points that I wanna share with you have to do with the mirror imaging. Here we have Adam, and Adam is mirror image just like this. He's also mirror image just like this. He's also mirror image just like this. He's also mirror image just like this, as well as here. In addition to that, we have with the image that the root of the genitalia in right here, as well as the genitalia. And the genitalia is also mirror image right here on the chin. We also know that the nose represents the penis and that there are some images that the nostrils represent the testicles. And the root of the genitalia is also mirror imaged on the cheek. So I think you know where I'm going with this. When you are struggling with having that headache and erectile dysfunction, I want you to do this protocol consistently. I want you to do it for a minimum of three minutes. You can do it as long as you would like. It's a great protocol to do when you're washing your face in the morning and evening. It can also help keep that blood flow in a very good place so that it can help prevent headaches and also keep you in a good place where you are helping the firmness and also the duration of your experience in the bedroom. So when you can, please do this consistently daily. What I want you to do is I want you to go from top to bottom, just like this. And in addition to that, I want you to also go top all the way down to the nose and then across just like this. So I will demo this for you in the following minute and be sure to do enough acupressure, minimum of three minutes daily as you are doing this at home. Here we go.
stay with it. Most patients see results within a few weeks to a few months. Work with your doctor and let me know in the comments if this is working for you. I'll redesign the protocol based on your feedback. And also if there's other topics you wanna to know more about, let us know in the comments. And also just a special message that I'm so proud to announce this, but we at Empirical Grace, we are putting our money towards establishing a free clinic. So if you want to give a, a donation and support us, it's the first link in the bio. I wanna thank you in advance for supporting us. Thank you for watching our videos. And I sincerely wish you the very best in being a man on the planet. From your friend and acupuncturist, Anita Tatabarthi. We would like to thank Anita's friends and business contacts who donated their time, money, and medical supplies to the Rapely Free Clinic. We're here in my grandfather's um, marriage hall, which has now been converted into our clinic or free hospital. Um, we have been here for four months, and we have treated about 1,000 patients with over eight or 9,000 patient visits. Most of the patients are farmers and agricultural workers, so a lot of the things that they're dealing with is uh, pain. There's lots of different